Hi guys, Bleach here working on the uh, Craftsman again. I just put a fuel shut off on there. It was too cheap to buy the clamps. And then it put it on there. This battery starts this Craftsman just fine. Won't start this, of course. Don't know why. I have to heck of a time starting this. It could be the uh, something wrong with the valves, maybe. I'm going to get a brand new battery. If it won't start with the new battery from uh, Tractor Supply, it will uh, need a valve adjustment. So right now I'm going to set up my tripod and I'm going to show you how to change this bearing here. I got the old one off. It's all broken and stuff. Um, so yeah, let's get going. I'm going to set up my tripod. Alright guys, hope you can see it okay. It appears you can. I'm going to get the new one out of the nice package. Oh yeah. Ow! Call over the tractor. Limited space, guys. Oh, I can't get the bag open. Hey, hey. This is going to be an exciting video. Can't you tell already, guys? Alright. It goes just like that. You put it over this. I think. Huh. Oh, it's different than the last one. I think. Was, huh. Let's go like this. Hope I got the right one, guys. Yeah, it's the right one. I guess it can go either way. And it goes like this. Yeah, it goes like that, guys. Different part numbers go different ways, guys. It just slides right in there. This one was on this way. Now, nope. yeah, this one's a little different. Hmm. Can't really tell because it's broke, guys. But I got it on there, right? Those are the little spider design there. I'm gonna tip this thing on its side in a minute and uh, see what could uh be wrong with the underneath why I won't go in the gear. I had to go get my liquor wrench too. This nut stuck in there good. Come on out of there, you. Alright. Hopefully I get the right size wrench. Perfect. I'm going to just twist them into there. I think. Uh-oh. It's not working, it's not working. Ready for some swears, guys? No, oh, come on, you. Alright. Well, I thought I'd show you how to do this. Nuts don't want to screw in there. Hope I don't strip it or something. The old ones came out of there easy. I don't know, this is dangerous. Alright, it's twisting and turning. It's going in there. Maybe because they're so new and not so uh, rusted. That's why they're going in there like this. This one looks crooked. No, Carol and Sal it crooked. We do everything backwards here anyways, guys. It'll straighten out after a while. tight enough guys watch it not steer after this wouldn't that be great guys wouldn't that be special it steers oh you probably get a nice view of my uh, bulb spot guys it's heck to be old the bald spot made appearances in other videos that you've seen. 
That's good. Now, I want to run something by you guys. Thought about painting this thing blue or purple. So I seen a kid do this with his craftsman. I forget what his name is. I'm going to put this back. How does it go? I don't know. That goes like that. We're live here, guys. We're live. Not really, but kind of. That goes like this. This goes on top. And that falls out, makes you swear. Look at that, just fell right out of there, guys. This thing even on. We can't afford batteries here, we're low budget. Oh yeah, guys, it's on. Put the steering wheel on like that. Come on. Uh oh. And we got the steering wheel together. And we'll put this on here. Now I gotta look for my uh, steering wheel nut. It turns to the right, the Titan, sometimes, or the left, or vice versa. I had to untighten it by turning the wrench to the right for some reason. And now it's turning to the right, the Titan. So go figure, guys. Hopefully this is the right one. Of course not. Here we go guys. I think this is it. Oh no. Well, I'm going to stop it here guys. Alright guys, we're back. As sad as that is, we're back. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to flop this thing on its side and check out the pulleys in a minute. Hopefully this is the right one. Let's see here. There we go. Strong and tight. At least I think it is. That's nah, not going to work. A little too big. Hold the steering wheel is tight. Hold it still. Tighten it with my right. I like working on these things, guys. So much fun. Only paid six fifty for that bearing you saw on eBay, and it's tight. I think a little more tight, maybe. got a lot of play in the steering wheel. Not sure why. I guess they all do that after a while things wear out. Alright, let's get the top of it. And find it. on there good enough guys let's get this thing on its side and see what's going on underneath and maybe just maybe we'll drive it today or tomorrow all right guys we're looking at this thing and guess what the uh oh yeah that's that's just delicious look at that guys it's really delicious so it looks like i got angry and just chewed right through the belt or it could be worn out you got hungry guys, but pulleys appear to be okay. So looks like we gotta buy a drive belt. Wonderful. Let's see if the uh hopefully this thing doesn't fall on me. Well, let's see if the uh rear pulley's okay. Turns. 
little stiff. All right, it goes to the right. It doesn't go to the left. It turns right. The engine turns right. It seems fine. Hopefully this thing goes in gear. Get all this grass and stuff out of here, guys. Watch a mouse jump out and start gnawing at my hand. That would be so exciting. Probably when it moves all this grass back here, too. So we got to buy a dry belt, it looks like, guys. How awesome. Knew that to begin with, probably. I'm going to let you guys go. Please comment and subscribe. And stay tuned. I should have a dry belt in a week or two. Because I really want to fix the MTD first and uh, get the snapper out of here because I don't like it. I mean, I do like it, but I'm tipping it on three wheels when I uh, use it. So, okay, guys, this is the end. Please comment and subscribe. Ooh, look at that. Tells you how to run the belt. That's awesome. That's awesome, guys. Tractor V drive belt. That's just great. I love that stuff. So if you forget, it's got a design right there. What is this? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Is that a drain hose of the transmission and I gotta put transmission fluid in this, guys? Please let me know. See that? Must be a drain hose of the transmission. Or it could be a drain so that battery box fills up with water it drains out. But I'm not sure on that. So bye, guys.